He's back. What's gonna happen? Today's the day. History be made. Round two. I'm packed up. It's time to get geared up. We also got some goodies in this bag over here. We're gonna extend the vent lines the right way, and we're gonna attach this massive snorkel. This is probably the biggest snorkel in history. How's it feel to make history? I make history every day. Can you turn this? It's not gonna this. That's from all that Honda suction. Mm. Sucks this thing down. Mm -hmm. You belt boys wouldn't understand. That's the thing. I mean, we're making history on something that a belt rider will never get to experience. And so we're doing this for you. I don't know why when they make Hondas, they don't come off the showroom floor in American collars, because this is American right here. America. Woo! It's swaying in the wind. <laughs> <laughs> this is madness. How are we gonna get the vent line up there? <laughs> a ladder. We're gonna have to get a ladder. How does it feel? Like, is it putting a lot of stress on the bracket? No, I'm more or less worried about the plastic here breaking. You know why the snorkel line's so high? Because God's gonna be breathing down in it for me. Mm. Higher the snorkel, the closer to God. Yep. I don't know what these go to, but they're connected as one now. Dude, this thing stinks. You got Fiona's weave under there. In the last video, guys, it was kind of destined to fail. The vent lines weren't not long enough, and we ended up getting water in them. So this time, he should be able to hang out underwater a lot longer, especially with the way that we're going to enter the pond this time. Things should go a little bit smoother, hopefully. And this is the redemption run. I mean, you got to respect that. At least she's going to get cleaned off, too. She's going to get a good bath. I don't know, it, got dirty. it was dirty when I pulled it out of there last time. I think that was what was coming out of your pants. It looks like we're getting a IV ready, man. We got, we're trying to save someone's life. How to save a life. That's your daily karaoke. Mm -hmm. Where did you go wrong? I lost a friend along the way. What do you mean? It's part of the song. Oh. He's hoisting his mast. Aye, aye, captain. Hey, another video idea. What? Making an actual sail. <laughs> Just going out on a lake and sailing. <laughs> Strapped a little barrels on the side of this. Mm -hmm. Little pontoons. How's the weather up there? Not bad. High as I can get. Let's get a helicopter for the other half. Whoa, 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 whoa. For the only fans. That's tight. Mm-hmm. This is what it's like getting dressed for success. Sponsored by Henderson. <laughs> That was a quick setup this time. DMX right now. What? Right here. What do DMX and Gramatron have in common? Nothing yet. Unless I don't make it up out of the pond. Damn, you finished my joke. Oh. That was wow. dark. That was a dark one. It was very dark. Oh. You gotta make sure you're limber and stuff. Did you hear that? That was my shoulders cracking. Hey, we ain't got workers comp here at Adventure Daily. How's it feel, man? Suiting up for the last time. Last time for the day. <laughs> That's the second gear. She runs. Water's cold. The only issue I see I'm having is going to be getting through the mud right here. I'm sinking pretty good. Nah, you'll be fine. There's a lot of undergrowth here. All I hear is excuses, man. A drop off. That actually ramps down pretty decent. Going in is going to be the hardest part. 
Once I can get past that lip, I think we'll be okay. Let's find out. We're gonna try to let all the air out of the back tires to hopefully stop the back end from rising up. You got a lot of volume in that air box too. Uh -huh. I think that's a lot of it. I'm actually going to be smart this time and get the Rubicon into position if I have to pull a little quick winch job. Rescue mission, here we go. Damn it, that was so close. Good job, man. Will you sit on the back of it? Will I? Yeah. Hell no. I'll start it right back up and keep riding it. You're still gonna go? We're still going. The problem is you got water in your exhaust now, my brother. But it blows out when you start it. Whatever you wanna do, man. He's a mechanic. That was a good one. Check the air box now. Let's see. Let's see. Snorkel never went under. How much though? A cat full. Oh my god. <laughs> no way. Hell yeah. Wow. I thought it was it, man. It was it. Vent lines are full. Here it goes. Everybody knows you never go full retard. smoking <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's in the vent lines yeah you just sucked it all in that's the only thing that bothers me now you got water in your gas let's go ahead and uh, go back treat this thing right alright so 
so. All right. Well, we're putting some fresh gas in there. Got all the vent lines blown out, and hopefully she's gonna start and purr and run just like she came from the factory, which I bet it will, because it's a Honda. Dude, that was getting deep. I don't even know if that pipe will be tall enough. Is it diluted enough? It's gonna take some cranking, so. You're still shooting water out of the exhaust, dude. Am I? Yeah. Yeah, it's pushing water out. Howdy that is. That's water. Well, you guys that's gonna wrap up today's video i hope you all enjoyed got a lot of hate on the last one so i'm sure we will but guys we're just having fun this is fun to us the rancher is fine it still runs and there's plenty of others out there so don't get so butthurt there will be a follow-up to this video one more try so if you are new make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out we're going for broke in the next one and we'll see what happens but if you enjoyed be sure to hit that like button thank you all if you made it this far and until the next video we'll see you then